Our first book, uh, which is the principles of Dr. Tierney's diagnostic process, but also should be Dr. Matsumura's uh, um, diagnostic process and translating ability, um, really uh, talks about how, what the general approach to a patient is. And it includes the, um, a lot of details about uh, the history, about the physical examination, uh, but more importantly, uh, a series of, uh, per of, of clinical pearls and of uh, cases that demonstrate them uh, throughout the rest of the uh, 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 book. It, um, it, it's told more or less like uh, a story and in a certain sense is not as dry as say a typical textbook might be. It's kind of fun to read uh, and go through those things and I think the reader will understand that this is um, where a lot of the fun in medicine is and we must have, if we're working this hard, we have to have some fun. Uh, and this book exemplifies how to start uh, on the road to that. In, the, in our second book, uh, which is entitled The Principles of <coughs> Dr. Tierney's Medical Practice, um, it, it, even though the picture on the front makes me look like I'm being pinched, uh, or maybe a little more serious than I ordinarily am. Uh, nevertheless, it is something that has, in addition to another series of cases and pearls, something that I don't think has been uh, written in any textbook uh, anywhere, which is the art of performing the spoken case presentation. Um, why is that so important? Well, for the most part, a um, doctor talks to other doctors or to students or to senior doctors um, in a way uh, that has been made a little too typical over time and for the most part isn't too interesting to listen to compared with normal conversation. We um, make a point of going into, in chapter two, into some detail about how a learner uh, can get by these, uh, these barriers to excellent use of language and to um, uh, communicate in a clear and interesting way so that his listener uh, will remain interested and after all you need to remain interested if you're going to uh, help your patient uh, and then again as, as I mentioned we have another series of cases with pearls in it I should say that uh, about a year from now, um, we're going to have a, uh, yet another book, which will be uh, a series of uh, uh, what are my uh, most favorite 100 clinical, <laughs> clinical pearls, which I'm looking forward very much to um, selecting and uh, modifying for purposes of uh, of uh, the next book in the series.